And we actually do have a player joining us now. We're so happy to have Peter Swidler joining us. Unfortunately, after a loss in this last round, Peter, how are you doing? Today wasn't a particularly good day. I left uh, a lot of points on the table today for no particular reason. Right. Uh, I had a I had a winning position in like three out of the five games, and uh, the last game was the only one that like I have no complaints about because my tournament situation is such that I felt I had to play sort of sharply for a win with black, and sometimes you get punished for that. All right. Well, uh, Peter, we have been very entertained with with your web camera that you're showing a lot of emotion. Is it hard uh, to keep it inside when you feel either you're doing great or I'm not or trying bad. to keep it inside. <laughs> I, I think uh, I think it's fine for people to see emotion when 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 we play. I I don't in particular because I have to say I found uh, looking at my opponent's camera a lot trickier in in, in Microsoft Teams than it normally is on Zoom. <laughs> on Zoom, I think people people can sort of snipe what you're thinking a lot easier. So on Zoom, maybe I would have made more of an effort not to be so transparent. But because, like at, at least in my personal experience, Microsoft Teams is very nice for camera capture, but not very nice for, you know, uh, watching uh, watching uh, other other players so i felt like if it's if it's only for the for the audience why am i supposed to to pretend everything is fine when everything is not fine <laughs> well we are very happy to see your emotions we, we try to read something out of it um, all the time and, and and peter you did tweet before this the skilling open you were uh, very anxious and very oh you seemed a little surprised to actually have qualified uh, to play here how are you feeling in the start here i feel like uh my my biggest issue is i, I feel a bit rusty honestly and i i've only sort of played myself into the tournament like yesterday really was i think very telling that i this year did not really play very much uh with this time control and in particular against you know fields of this strength so i was kind of relearning uh relearning on the go today was generally better but still like it's it's inexcusable not to win the positions I had today. Not to win a single one of those is just completely horrible. And I think it's mainly to do with, with lack of practice more than anything else. So, Peter, we've played each other many times online. I think you knew it was me, despite pretend that, I, well, I thought I was anonymous <laughs> at the time. Um, what would you say are the big differences between online speed chess and over the board? And maybe the differences between these guys as well, the very top guys uh, facing them? Well, I think I think time management online is slightly trickier. Although all of us have gotten used to it to some degree, but in particular when you play rapid online, I think um, uh, originally when this time control started becoming a thing, uh, it was a bit of an issue for people not to treat it as some kind of a weirdly long blitz. And, uh, you know, some people had very, you know, well-publicized issues with it, like playing as if it's a blitz game and then, you know, only stopping when nothing could be done anymore. Uh, and it's also possible to go exactly the other way around and think, you know, 15 minutes, it's a tremendous amount of time. I can just pause for like half of that time here and try to figure something out. And then you don't have enough time for the rest. But... I, I don't think it's a it's much of an issue anymore. Uh, for me, the, the issue really is that it's a very strong field, and I've uh, you know apart from you know occasional once a week blitz tournaments, I have haven't really played much chess in the past I don't know three months, and uh, it's it's very telling I think in uh, in how I you know convert things how uh, like I. I, I, I struggled to play, uh, you know, a game from start to finish uh, with with the same quality. Some of the games were fine for, you know, vast majority of it, and then I would go completely crazy in the end. Mm -hmm. So, well, the standard has not been as poor as I was kind of worried it might be, but still, nothing, nothing to be happy about. All right. Well, can you promise us to keep entertaining us with showing emotions on your web camera tomorrow? <laughs>
that, 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 that definitely will continue. All right, perfect. Thank you so much, Peter. Good luck on the last day of Round Robin tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah.